Three weeks after Father Tom went missing following a terror attack in Aden, Ministry of External Affairs has confirmed that the priest has been abducted in Yemen by a terror group and efforts are on to secure his release. The government is not uh, properly working and our embassy is not functioning there. Even then, uh, she has promised to do whatever possible thing to save him. So today, we again request an appeal to the government. Even as his family anxiously awaits his arrival, Father Tom's friend claims he's safe. Trying through different channels. First of all, at the congregation level, we are trying through Vatican. They are diplomats. They are in Kuwait, based in Kuwait. And so then uh, we also through the um, the government of India, Ministry of External Affairs, and uh, they are also aware of it, and uh, they are also trying their best. Hundred percent, he is safe. However, uh, within a couple of days. There might be, there might be, this is again, I, I use the word, there might be uh, some kind of negotiations uh, that might be opening up. See, until yesterday, they were not willing to negotiate. Our contacts had tried hard and uh, uh, even uh, it was, uh, there had been life, uh, th uh, life threats that was uh, hurled against the people who were trying to communicate with them. But uh, today, within, I mean, today, that was, this is a new development that has happened with it. They said they will, they will... Uh, Kind of they will open up for negotiations. Father Tom left India in 2010 and had been working at an old age home in Aden for over four years when the ISIS attack occurred. India now prays for Father Tom's safe return. Bureau Report, Times Now.